Hey everyone, this is Pastor Stephen Everett Halstead coming to you from the Greenview Alliance Church Library uh, here with a, an informational video um, to connect with you in a time that we're finding it very difficult to connect other than a phone call and obviously not face to face. Um, but uh, here we want to just make you aware of three tools that are available on our church website. Um, for those of you who don't know, our, our church website is greenviewalliance.com. If you just type that into the uh, search bar at the top, uh, this is the screen that will come up. Um, the top right-hand corner, the first tool I want to make you aware of is Right Now Media. When you click on this, it will uh, open up a new tab and you will be able to put in a profile and your email and all that and it'll just uh, set up a profile for you. And uh, from there, you will have access to... Uh, all of these videos, um, Bible studies, personal Bible studies, finances, on the left it breaks down a whole bunch of different categories um, that you can look at. Um, so we use a lot of them for our training ground classes. I use them for youth group. Um, the very, there is kids, um, popular kids shows. Uh, if you click on the far right, you're going to see all, and it's got all of these the videos. And there's, these aren't just the videos, these are the titles. And then if you go inside of them, it'll show you um, the first volume, and there could be more than one volume within that. Um, you just click on the volume you want. Uh, VeggieTales has a whole lot. There's over 2,500 kids' videos. So for all you parents at home that are going a little crazy and you just need a little downtime, I do not recommend that the kids watch TV all day. I'm just going to say that right now. Um, for them to get out um, when it gets warmer or just to have a activity at home um, in the living room. Um, have, my daughter's just set up a store and everyone got fake money that they had to go buy stuff. And so they emptied out our cabinets and we bought the stuff to put back into the cabinets. It was a lot of fun, but it gave them something to do and they weren't staring at screens all the time. But if you do need a break and the kids need it just to sit down time, this is a very good uh, resource uh, for you. So that's Right Now Media. Again, if you have any questions with any of these or need help, feel free to call the church or to give me a call personally, um, and I'll be more than happy to help you out. So that's tool number one, Right Now Media. Again, the church pays for this, but it does not cost you anything, so please take advantage of that tool. Uh, the second thing um, that I want to draw your attention to is at the top. You're going to see it says Submit a Prayer Request. Um, if you click on that, it will open up a prayer request. You can put your name in, last name, email, and then your prayer request. And um, the, the church office will get that request, and then it gets forwarded to uh, to us as elders so we can be praying for you and, and lifting you up and um, just be aware of what's going on in a time that obviously it's hard to, again, connect face-to-face -face right now. So um, feel free to take a, a advantage of that. Um, and, and the third tool that I want to make you aware of that um, we just put together this week, obviously because of the circumstances we find ourselves in, is Give. Um, this is going to take you to a, a website um, or to a pop-up that's going to say uh, Greenview Alliance Church, the amount that you want to give. Um, so let's just put in $50. And then you can scroll down. If you want, you can sign up or log in so that you don't have to continue to put in for your information. But if you're, it's not something you're comfortable with, but you still want to be able to give to the church during this time, then I would recommend not signing up or logging in, but just giving um, each week as you feel led. Um, the next part of this is you can click on this drop-down tab. It says General Fund, Great Commission Fund, People Helping People, Missions, or Other, and then you would specify. Uh, general fund obviously is what you guys are aware of and we give to each week uh, that pays for the bills, our salaries, uh, toilet paper, um, all those things. So, um, But uh, the one I just I do also want to make you aware of is the People Helping People Fund. Um, obviously, we're navigating interesting times right now and a lot of people are um, uh, without a job, um, are going to be without a job for a little bit. So that's going to put a financial stress on. So that's another way to give and just um, bless um, people. And uh, the deacons will, will administrate that as, as they s learn of needs. Um, so uh, you can, again, click on that tab and then click how to give. Um, and then there's a reoccurring giving. Uh, you might have to sign up for that. I'm not really sure. Um, if you, you have to create a login. Um, then you put your name in. Uh, Steve Halstead. And this is for recording records so that... Um, at the end of the year, you can get your tax write-offs. Uh, you put your email in because then you'll get a, a receipt for that. Uh, address, city, um, all that's going to go in, in coordination with um, if you use a card. They're going to have to verify your card address. And then you would put your 
credit card number in. Um, and then this little box is an interesting box. It's called Cover the Fees because there's obviously fees to giving it online. Um, so I can't remember exactly what the amount is. I know if you... Uh, I'm going to guesstimate at this. If you give, let's say you're writing a check or you want to give $1,000, your fee is probably going to be around $15. Um, so just be be aware of that. And um, if you want to cover those fees, you would click on Cover the Fees. Um, and then at the very end, you would just click Give. Um, and again, another way that you can connect and worship during this time when it, we can't get together uh, to worship. So... Um, with that being said, I just want to remind everyone that we are doing a live uh, stream on Sundays. Uh, we did our first one this last Sunday. Um, we'll send out a link on Facebook and we will email everyone as well um, that that don't have Facebook that would need the link. Um, if you don't, if you know of anyone that's not receiving that link, did not receive it this Sunday, please, please, please contact the church and let us know um, so that we can uh, be sure to send that link out um, and we'll go from there. Uh, with that being said, uh, love you guys. Uh, sorry we can't see face to face, but uh, looking forward to seeing how God uses this. Um, James 1 talks about, may I consider it pure joy when you face trials of many kinds. And so uh, in light of uh, everything we're going through, may we consider it pure joy and, and may it be a time of uh, refining us and causing us to, to really search our souls. Again, love you guys and we'll talk to you later.